What's up everybody? Miss Montana DeLeon here. Okay, um, this is a video for the gentlemen out there. And I just got off the phone with my good, good friend, Kari. Hi, Kari. Um, and this video is to let men know, and a few women have said it too under the video that I did about what men need to know. Put your, you know, questions under there, or topics that I need to address. A few women also, you know, mentioned that it's the small things that men forget to do. The little things to show that they care, they love you, and they're putting thought into being with you. Now, today at work, a gentleman came in. He was like, yo, can I get a, uh, you know, gift card, you know, for my girl so she can buy some makeup. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know how much should I put on it. Like, $20, $25? I'm like, nah, dude. Like, you only get a foundation for, like, $28. She won't be able to get that. He was like, all right, let's do 50. I was like, all right, but are you going to buy her a gift along with it? You know, to show that you put some thought into something and not just throwing her a gift card. Gift cards are cool. We get to get what we want then. But buying us a gift, it's like, oh, he bought me this. And then, okay, we're about to go shopping with what I really want because he didn't know because he's not a mind reader with this gift card. So if you're going to do a gift card, great, perfect, wonderful. Put as much money as you can on the gift card. She'll go ham. She'll find a way to spend it. But what's so special about it is you bought her a gift with it so you put a little bit of thought behind what she might like in addition to the gift card so that's wonderful another thing um is i've dated a lot of guys that had money that you know just throw you some money and be like all right huh baby yeah go shopping go do this go do that go do that go go take the kids to the movies go do this go do that whatever um but they're not around they throw money wire money to the account whatever it is but they're not around yeah, that's not really a relationship. I don't care how much money you're giving me. I'm going to need some QT, some quality times, a little lovey-dovey, a little something, something. You know what I'm saying? You can't just be throwing me some cash and thinking I'm just going to go entertain myself because you're so busy making more cash. Not going to work. Not going to work for me. Maybe when I was like in my early teens, late teens, it was cool. But now it's like, no, nah, I'm cool on all that. Dude, you got to be a man. Um... Another thing is doing the little stuff. The little stuff goes a long way. Buy her a card, like Kari said. Buy her a card instead of signing your name on it. Give her a little sweet little note on the card. You know, give her that. Buy her a gift just because it's Wednesday. I do that for my man. Just buy gifts just because it's Thursday and just because I think you look cute today or you had a great haircut. You know, I'll give you some fellatio for taking out the trash. Just little things, little you know, little things like that. Oh, that is so funny about the whole fellatio thing. Because I just was talking to my dude about that. That is so funny. Um, no, really, it is funny. Laugh out loud. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> but um, it's just simple things. It's like taking them out on dates. Kari said that. To take them out on dates. Still date your girl. I don't care how long y'all been together. Still take them out on dates. Baby, I want you to get dressed. I want you to get ready. But even better, buy her a nice, sexy dress. Something that you know she'll look good in. Something that you don't mind her wearing out in public as long as she's with you. Buy her something sexy. Some little shoes or whatever to go with it. Or a dress. And a gift card so she can buy her own shoes. And lay it on the bed and be like, babe, I want you to wear this Saturday night, Friday night. I'm going to take you out somewhere night, nice, somewhere special. So ask your homeboys, you know, a little nice little spot. Or if you know a little nice little spot that you want to take your girl, do that. Take her out. Date her. You know, open the door. Get a little flowers. You know, the whole shebang. Do the whole shebang. Um, Ari's texting me now. Shut up. We're trying to do this video. Kari, chill out. I was trying to do this video. Hold on, son. Um... Yeah, do the whole, you know, the little stuff. You know what I'm saying? Make her breakfast some mornings. You know what I'm saying? Coffee in bed uh, in the morning when she wakes up. Get a newspaper, get her slippers. Whatever it is that she does, take heed to that and, and, and you know, do something special. Just something. Just think of something. Get creative. Do the little things. Give her a little, you know, his and her spa day. Well, both of y'all go to the spa, get little massages, get your feet done or whatever. Men got to take care of their feet, too. That's not gay. Take care of your feet. Feet your hands. Take care of that. Manicure, pedicure. Handle that. Just don't put no shiny polish on there. You tell them to buff it, but don't put no shiny polish on there. But definitely get the feet and them hands tight. So y'all go to the spa together, get his and hers massages, you know, facials, manicures, pedicure, whatever y'all need to do. Do something together as a couple, something fun. Um... For instance, like, I mean, yeah, of course you want to spend money on your girl, but at the same time, you want to personalize stuff and do stuff from the heart as well. So, my dude sent me an iPad for Christmas. 
I saw the iPad and I was like, oh my god! And it's like the newest one and all that stuff. And I'm like, ah! whatever and then on top of that he sent me his dog tags because he's over in Afghanistan and along with the dog tags he sent me a nice little letter so I got this and I opened it up and he also sent me one of his um one of his army shirts so I'm just like you know I'm like that right <laughs> So yeah, the iPad costs way more than the dog tags and the shirt and the note, but the note and the, and the doll and every the whole meaning behind it was just like, oh, it was like that. So it was like, ah, like, he's good at this. He's good at this gift giving stuff and this little things. He's good at that. He's so good at that, yo. Mm. And my ex is not good at that. And so it's so weird to just have that type of person. It's just so weird. It's just weird, okay, to have somebody just to do um, stuff that you always wanted and they do it and it's like, oh my gosh, so this how this feels? Oh, this is good. I like this. I like this a lot. Do more of that. So he's really good at that. Um, so I appreciate that. Um, but yeah, it's definitely like the little things, guys. Don't forget to do the little things and she'll appreciate it a lot. A lot, a lot, compared to any kind of money you can throw her, depending on what kind of chick you got. If you got a gold digging chick, she, you know, what you doing with this this little Hallmark card? Talking about you love me, you want to marry me one day. Boy, give me some money, you know what I'm saying? Depending on what kind of chick you got. You might have a chick that appreciates that type of stuff. A mature chick that's really, you know, knows her worth and knows what it entails to have a good relationship. And she's going to appreciate the stuff that you put thought into and you put your heart into making it happen. So, ooh, I'm, I've been talking too much. Let me get off this video. But you get it. Just do the little things. Don't just throw out some cash. Don't just pay no attention. Just don't be tapping the butt. Just just do what you got to do to show her you care. Show her you love her with gifts and things you put thoughts in and taking her out and just surprising her with flowers and just stuff for no reason at all. Spa dates. Take her to Vegas for a weekend. Do something. Cook for her. Whatever you can do. Don't forget, dude. Don't take your girl for granted because somebody else is going to be like, Hey, what's up, Mom? You looking good today. Does anybody tell you look good today? And you didn't tell her she looked good today? Mm, his his words gonna hold, hold his his words are gonna hold more weight than what you did all day. So it's because he did something that you ain't doing. He doing the twenty percent. You may be doing eighty, but the little twenty percent is like looking real good right now because you ain't getting it at home. So stay on top of your game. Stay on top of your game. Stay on top of your girl. Make sure she happy. You know, just take care of home, baby. Take care of home, baby. Don't let nobody else do what you can be doing, what you should be doing, what you know you can be doing. So, you know, hand me a bendit. Hand me a bendit. That's right. Hand me a bendit. Check your relationship. <laughs> Love some.